The Official End of Swamp People Swamp People has undergone severe controversy that may lead to the eventual end of the show and the cast members' careers and legacies. Hurry up, shoot him, shoot him. Got alligators out on lawns, right? Swamp People is a show all about hunting gators during the 30 day alligator season every year. And while the show does make for amazing spectacles and action packed moments involving the gators, multiple people do not approve of the treatment of the gators on the show. Many individuals and groups criticize the brutality of the show and how alligators and their well-being are mostly being neglected and violated. Somebody's excited to see us. Be a real one-shot wonder. Hurry up, get the gun. Shoot, Chase, come on! Unsurprisingly, multiple activist groups such as PETA have slammed Swamp People and the A&E Network for their treatment of animals on the show. And at one point, they even begged for the show to be canceled. They argue that the show promotes violence and hatred towards alligators and other animals that are regularly featured on the show. People worry that the younger generation will not treat animals well based on the content depicted on Swamp People. Alligators often go out in brutal ways on the show, and the cast members who do get those alligators down are often rewarded for their actions. In response to this, many Swamp People supporters mention that the show is not meant to spread a negative influence, but rather to honor an ancient Louisiana tradition of hunting gators and then selling them for the benefit of all. Many argue that the show is intended to be entertainment and educational rather than hostile or harmful. Regardless of your opinion on the matter, this controversy has plagued the show since its earliest days and will likely continue to be mentioned in anything Swamp People related. It's strong controversies like these that have the potential to cancel a show entirely. And with our modern society becoming more and more caring to animals, it is likely that the controversy will continue to grow and stir up. I'm a floating bicycle. I know it might sound a little crazy, but sometimes, man, I don't know, you just get a crazy idea. And my crazy idea was this floating bicycle. Mm. So I need a, I need a way to New Orleans, bro. New Orleans. New Orleans. Right now. If many people start boycotting Swamp People and the a &E Network over this controversy, it could seriously hinder the show's performance and standing as a television show. As superficial as it sounds, if a show is not getting enough ratings or is damaging the reputation of the network hosting the show, chances are that show is going to get cancelled and never bought back. The network may even want to forget the show occurred in the first place and pretend like it didn't happen. Come on, Joe! Joe, watch him, be careful! Oh, 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 oh! Watch out, watch out, get up there! Get up there, I'm throwing him in! Can you put him in the boat live? Why not? <sighs> Dead live as long as he's in the boat! <sighs> Swamp People is most well known for the dramatic action sequences between the hunters and the gators, and at multiple times, the hunter's life is put on the line. It's scenes like these that really put Swamp People on the map and help it become one of the highest viewed series on the A&E network. These scenes usually come up with amazing cinematic shots and visuals of the action happening, but Swamp People has been accused of faking entire scenes and alligator encounters. From all the different camera angles, lighting, and perfect timing of everything, 
it seems unlikely that the camera crew could actually record some of those visuals and shots at specific angles. This caused many viewers to come to the conclusion that Swamp People is an inauthentic show, which further damaged the reputation of the show and the performance of it. Time to get a shot on him. Hurry up, get a shot. That might be the bounty right there. You never know, that might be the one. Ain't no pirate of the body no more. It'll be the pirate of somebody's purse. It also doesn't seem likely that the show would put the cast members in genuine real danger, since it could cause many lawsuits or worst of all, fatal injuries to the cast members or the camera crew. Many people believe that the show utilizes alligator corpses that have already been hunted and taken down and uses them as substitute for actual gators. Furthermore, there is often an element of storyline and drama, such as arguments that appear on the show. You got a lot of people. You don't like all the people? Uh, people don't bother me, it's just how many people they got, bro. <laughs> I ain't a city person, man. I don't know the first thing about New Orleans, but I knew I had to see Peter before my idea runs out. You just follow your dream. <laughs> Swamp People has also been accused of faking drama between cast members to create tension and keep viewers watching. Swamp People has seen massive success due to the fact that many saw the cast as humble and authentic people, which is why many fans may have lost interest in the show after Swamp People has been accused of faking certain elements of the show, causing a decline in viewership, which may ultimately lead to the show's cancellation. And Jacob's concerned the young captain won't be able to handle the pressure this season. We had a bum day yesterday, and first day of the season is just, it's lost. And I have no clue what Chase was messing with this morning. A year like this, is you need to get in there, knock the tags out, and get out, and be done as quickly as possible. I just don't see Chase being a captain like that year after year if he doesn't straighten up. The problem is, is that many of these cast members have either aged significantly or moved on from the hunting scene. Keep in mind, Swamp People came out nearly 10 years ago. And since then, many of the core casts have aged, which can be a significant problem, since gator hunting is an activity that requires sharp cognitive focus and physical mobility. All of these reasons could factor in to the official end of Swamp People.